Hey guys, so we have seen so many stuff about the Galaxy S8 in the past week. Thanks to all these leaks, now we know how the phone looks like. Some huge design changes are there such as the death of the traditional home button in favor of it an all screen curve edge display with 83% plus screen to body ratio. So the last week we saw a brand new real life image of the Galaxy S8. From the well known mixture of leaks, this leaks push the fingerprint scanner on the back of the device which means that the killer feature we talked about the optical fingerprint scanner may not happen with the Samsung Galaxy S8. After all, and it might be featured with the granddaddy of them all, the Galaxy Note 8, the True Notes and the replacement phone. Far from the crazy display and a huge design change, there will be a unique piece of the Galaxy S8 which most probably will not be seen on the other phones this year. Samsung is rumored to offer visual search capabilities in the upcoming Galaxy S8 allowing users to search for objects identified in a photograph. A new report claims that the big speed of the AIS system of the Galaxy S8 will analyze the shot, identifying the objects and the text in the frame and then perform usable searches functionality. This is very similar to the Google goggles and the app that performs similar object and text recognition from images, but it is claimed that Samsung will take this concept to a next level. The fourth button we saw on the Galaxy S8 in the leaks is indeed real and it is dedicated to launch the AI Assistant. So it seems that Samsung is really really serious about the AI Assistant thing and they want to bring some features that you will not going to see on the other phones this year. The Galaxy S8 will finally bring a RAM of 6GB with 128GB variant and a 64GB storage variant will come with 4GB of RAM. And no plan whatsoever currently for the 256GB variant and thank the lord they have decided to keep the 3.5mm headphone jack as some newly designed diagrams we have seen at the Korea about the Galaxy S8 screen. So no flat screen Galaxy S8 this year. Moreover the report says that the Galaxy said we will use on screen navigation buttons, fingerprint scanner will be reportedly be placed beside this camera sensor and there would be an additional physical key on the right side of the device for accessing the AI assistant and the other functions. Samsung is also working on the newly completely wireless earphones again while keeping the headphone jack. And it's pretty much confirmed that the Galaxy S8 will not be revealed on February 26 even that we have. Instead, Samsung is going to launch the new Galaxy Tab S3 but a new report just came saying that the company is going to give audience a glimpse of his next flagship beast by showing them a short one minute video, a short trailer showcasing the new design and possibly some features that we can't wait. Finally official Samsung teaser is coming this month and also Galaxy S8 battery will be made by a new Japanese company according to a leakster. Asian marketers have the option to choose between 64 GB of storage or 128 GB of internal storage. The price for the 64 GB I said will be roughly $885 and for the other one it will be $943 approximately. So that's all we have on the upcoming Samsung Galaxy S8. We hope you guys like the video. Please like, share and subscribe for daily tech videos.